Hey guys, Yost here. Uh, this video was inspired by a thread on the Acoustic Player Magazine forum about artificial harmonics and uh, I was too lazy to just type the entire answer so I thought I'd record it. Um, I'm about to show you what I've learned from watching guys like Tommy Manuel uh, about harp-like artificial harmonics. Now, basically what I've learned is that artificial harmonics aren't artificial at all. They're actual harmonics. They're the 12th fret harmonics I'm playing here. Um, and basically, every uh, string has several harmonics, the 12th, the 7th, and the 5th string harmonics, and they're actually the same if you move up that way, the same direction from the 12th fret. Um, and what you can do is you can add to those harmonics by fretting with your left hand, and basically what you're doing then is moving up the nut of your guitar and thus moving up the position of the 12th fret harmonic. So you could fret at the fifth string and you'd get 12th fret harmonics here. Now, the first thing you have to learn when you start playing these artificial harmonics is to think fast here because you have to get the position exactly right. So move up the same amount of frets uh, from the 12th fret for the harmonic, fingering the note like this, as you have uh, fretted here, so that's fifth, uh, five frets up here. And then um, there are two ways to play them. Well, actually, there's three. The uh, classical guitar guys have have a way, but I don't know how, so I'm not going to show you that one. Uh, basically, what you have uh, is the way of the flat pick and the way of the thumb pick. Now, first with the flat pick, what you do is you hold the flat pick between your middle finger and your thumb and then you use your index finger to finger the node while of course the flat pick picks the string. So what you do here is uh, open strings, place your finger over the 12th fret, uh, don't press it out down, just lightly touch it and just pick the string uh, with your pick. Uh, this isn't the easiest way to play these uh, artificial harmonics, especially uh, the harp-like because well, you, you need to hold it and, and then you lose a finger compared to when you have the thumb pick, you can just use your thumb for everything. But just to show you, uh, you can uh, use them uh, for these harp-like harmonics like this. see you can blend the 12th fret with the 7th fret harmonics and even the 5th fret if you want to. Uh, but so much for the flat pick, the thumb pick is easier because you can do the same thing with four fingers left. Like that. So what I did there, if I bar at the 5th fret for example, then um, we extend the roll by first doing the, fir the bass strings open like this or well fretted, no harmonics. Then we touch the harmonic, we blend in an uh, open note, a fretted string, the G string, then the A, then the B, then the D, then the E, like that. And you can go back like this. And uh, all you need there is some practice to get it going. Uh, and I still haven't perfected the technique, but basically what you want to do is make sure you get the volume of the harmonics the same as the volume of the fret string. So uh, it'll blend into each other. And don't try to do this playing the harmonic hard. Play it softly, or normally I, I would say, and try to match the volume of the open string by playing that softer than usual. So like this. And you can uh, make it even longer by using pull-offs, or hammer-ons for that matter. So on the uh, open E, the high E, you could uh, start with a harmonic, sorry, then with a pull-off,
like that. Now, when you do this, make sure you really extend your finger and that you really nail the spot to get it sounding good. And I've found that extending the finger gives me a better tone because it'll also allow me to push my thumb back a little further to get a really clean sound. Like that. Now you have to learn how to shoot fast, so to speak, because if you start complicating the shape, then you have to move your right hand from string to string as well, just to make sure you keep getting the, the 12th fret harmonic. So the opening chord for Michelle, like this, is a bar at the first, fourth fret. Then uh, you add your pinky to the seventh fret on the A string or the fifth string, so to speak, and you go like this. fifth like that and also there's this chord and you have to move up even farther so you get beyond where the frets are and this is again practice to make sure you get the position right now watch the right hand as you see I'm moving up and down the frets with uh, the same shape as my finger of the fingers of the left hand to make sure I get the harmonics right. So again, basically it's nothing more than uh, getting the node, open string, node, open string, node, open string, node, and back. Well, I hope this helped and see you guys later.